Greetings all, Devious Monkey here. Today, I'm gonna give you sort of a studio tour. I know you can see the bookshelves behind me, but you can't see all the other stuff that I've redone, like right in front of me. And it's been a while since I changed everything up. I also cleaned because there was so much shit everywhere and it was starting to stress me out that I had so much stuff out and in, in, in. So I'm gonna grab the ZV-1 now and sort of scan around here and show you everything rather than move all this stuff because it's a pain in the ass to put it all back and get it in the right spot. So without further ado, okay, so nothing's really changed over here so much is that I still have my little battery area here where I charge everything. And then we zoom on over here and this is where I usually keep the camera. So you can see the GoPro, well, well you could have seen the GoPro until I stuck my hand in there. The GoPro goes there. The ZV-1 actually goes in that empty spot. There's my still A6600. And then I put the lenses back there and just a couple other things. Over here just sort of becomes a dumping ground for stuff. And that's what I had to put away because I had it filled with stuff that I did not want out. And that's what was stressing me. Now this little end table here has become my Insta360 section, as you can see. So I've got a few of the tripods and the selfie stick, but all the extra batteries and the charging stuff. And I actually ran a new multi-outlet power strip because the one that I had in there only turned in the one direction so that if you put something that had a big brick, it took up like two to three of the plugs and you know and then I can only plug two things in. So here's the other thing that changed is this little section here. So I normally had the chair sitting there like that, but then I got this little table which matches the one that I have over there for my company laptop. But I put this down here so that you can see that I have my iPad mini on there. And when I record videos, I'm sitting at this chair and I basically throw everything over here on this little shelfy thing that I built. And really I put that there strictly for the cat to be able to sit up there and look out the window when he's in here hanging out with me. But I started throwing a bunch of crap on there. Like right now I've got that cotton carrier and the Insta360 because I was showing it to you guys the other day. And then I like throw shit down here and put it all on top of that thing. And I would be reaching left and right and grabbing stuff and throwing it down on the floor. And I thought it'd be perfect if I got another one of those, it's almost like a TV tray and you can lift the shelf up, down. You can tilt it, angle it and all that kind of stuff. And I thought it would just be perfect to have that there so that I had something to set whatever I'm going to show you down right there so that I'm not really breaking eye contact with the camera. And it's also right in front of me just to make it convenient. Now we have obviously the shelves. Then as far as the rest of the place goes, I still have the Canon photo printer. And then I have my company laser jet. And then over here again, I have all my hard drives that run along here and then my 27 inch iMac. And then I have my 27 inch LG monitor, the 40 inch Sony TV up there. And then everything else just sort of pans around and I have that other little desk here or, or little whatever you want to call it, TV tray for my company laptop and the mouse and all that shit. And then, you know, then it's just the rest of the, the room. And I hang stuff from all these things. Now the, the little brackets there and up there, those are actually up there to hold the green screen that I have because I really don't do any green screen stuff anymore. It's just rolled up and it's down in the garage, kind of down there with that gigantic soft box, but it's up there if I need it. So I can drop any background up there or the green screen if I need to. And then I have another stool there if I have somebody sitting here that we're BSing or whatever. But for the most part, this is kind of where everything goes and the way that I've got it all set up. And then if I back up here, Now you can see that's pretty much that side's the studio side, that side's the office side. And this is where I spend the bulk of my time when I'm awake, especially since I'm not on the road anymore. So here's where the magic is. Okay. That's really all I wanted to show you to show you how I have everything set up and I can sit here, have all my stuff right in front of me 
so that I'm grabbing things and, and like, instead of going over here like this and having to cut all that shit, you know, I can have what I'm going to show you just sitting here on the desk and be like, Oh yeah. I see the Insta 360 on the little backpack clamp and all that kind of stuff. Oh, and also today I found out that that spins game changer helps to read the directions. I don't follow my own advice. So that's it. I just wanted to give a quick studio office tour again, since I've changed so much and added things and taken stuff out. And I don't know that I showed everything properly since I put the shelves up when I built those and most of that was done in time lapse. So that's it. That's all I got for you today. If you have any questions or comments, leave them down below. As always, like, subscribe, all that shit. And remember kids, forward and up.